a visual arts uh, scholastic event. It's an event uh, statewide that kids across in high school get to enter their art in a competition and also be interviewed for the purpose of the art. Junior Face is the um, younger version of the Visual Arts Scholastic event. Um, it's our large district contest that we have every spring. So the process for VASE is they create an art piece, 2D or 3D, and then they go to an interview process on site, and then jurors will um, vote on which one is the best, and they get to go to another level, which is called state VASE. For VASE, I am creating this piece, and it is a piece commemorating my grandfather who passed away. So this is a sculpture. It's made out of paper mache, cardboard, foil and wire and it represents the complexity of my daily life. The best part is them getting to voice their reason behind their art and their why. In the real world, selling art is really hard so if they learn how to do that now, uh, this competition helps them get used to that. Probably the best thing I like about my students participating in VASE is they get to kind of come up with their own style. I like to see what they can come up with because they get to kind of explore some materials that they might not have really managed in a regular class project. Like, we like to introduce a lot of stuff that sometimes they don't get to explore as freely as they might want. And so to give them just like full on access, be like, here's everything I have. What do you want to do? And just see where they go with it is just really, really amazing to me. Last year for Vase, it was like, I realized that it takes a lot of time because we worked on it for like a good one to like three weeks. And so with it, you learn how to like um, proportion your stuff out, how to uh, like set up your things and stuff, know what you need, know what you want to do, and how you're going to do it. I learned that I need to be a little, little neater with my pencil work. Uh, there's definitely a lot of good artists out there, so it was definitely a competition that was worth doing. I feel like they, they hold themselves to a higher standard once they're like, this is how good I could be. Or, when they see that um, there's two levels to medal, like you can get a medal just for like mastering your age level and your group level. And then there's a platinum, which means you have gone beyond mastery into like newer levels, like you're way past where you should be. And so when they see other students earning platinum, they're like, ooh, I bet I could have done that. And it kind of challenges them and pushes them a little farther in their stuff. So I really loved it. Yeah, just knowing that there's no way to get a hundred percent and all I can do is do my best. For me, I like, like, what I really do love about art is that you can express yourself any way you want to. And it won't be like judged as, oh, this is just a piece. No, it'll be looked into more like, oh, you see the emotion and the detail that comes in with it. I just like how I get to create things that you can't see in daily life and how you can play around with the colors and the things you see and create something beautiful or sometimes unexplainable. I love art because it's not the same as any of the other subjects and it's so nice to be able to just sit down and paint a picture or draw something that you like to create. The thing I love about art the most is that it has a lot of diverse mediums so you don't have specific styles. Of course you can be influenced by other artists in past lives and um, stuff like that but of course you can find your own style and you can elaborate on that style and you can pretty much create your medium. You can, it can be oil pastels, crayons, color pencils, paints, anything, and you can even create new things. What I love about art is that you can create different things and use your inspiration to make stuff that you love, like with, work with your hands, or you can color and stuff like that. I'm a little bit nervous, but I think I'm gonna do great. Mm -hmm.